Hello, I'm Pushkar, master teacher in chemistry at Vedantu. I'm discussing problems of chemistry in J Advanced 2020 Prop paper. Let's discuss this problem. The problem is simple problem of acid base titration. In this problem, 5 ml of 0.1 oxalic acid solution was taken in conical flask and was titrated with NH from a burette using phenolphthalein as indicated. You know that at the end point, the phenolphthalein will become pinkish, paint pink color, and you will stop the titration. So during this titration, five times this experiment was carried out. And first time you got 12.5 ml volume reading. Second time your reading was 10.5. Third time it was 9, 9, fourth and fifth, 9 as well. So the confusion could arise that whether to take average of these values, okay, but no. No average is needed. In fact, the most precise value, we give you also call it tighter value, is 9. That means the volume of NH should be taken as 9. So I think that is the only novelty in this question, only special thing in this question. The rest everything is quite simple. So the fundamentals of this problem is number of milli equivalents of oxalic acid should be equal to number of milli equivalents of NaOH okay so would you like to solve it by equivalent method or by mole method there are two ways in which you can solve it if you solve it by the mole method what you have to do to write the full equation which is COOH COOH twice of NaOH will give you COO negative COO negative Na plus Na plus plus twice H2O that means 5 ml into 0 0.1, which is equal to 0.5 millimole of this will require 1 millimole of NaOH. That will be the way of mole concept. In this way, you have to balance this equation and do it by the mole way. So 1 millimole of NaOH is required. And as you, if you notice that 9 ml of NaOH was used, so definitely this 1 millimole must be equal to 9 into the molarity and this gives us the molarity is equals to 1 upon 9 which is 0 0.11 and that's your answer so if you solve it by the equivalent method then we have to use the funda number of milli equivalents of COOH COH that is oxalic acid is equal to number of milli equivalents of NaOH and the normality of uh, normality of oxalic acid solution should be as you know the formula normality normality is equals to molarity into n factor of coh that is equals to 2 so this gives you the normality n is equals to 0 0.2 n normality is equals to 0 0.2 n that means milli equivalent of oxalic acid is equal to 0 0.5 into 2 is equals to 1 milli equivalent and that is equal to milli equivalent of NaOH and since the normality normality of NaOH is equal to molarity of NaOH because because the n factor of NaOH is equals to 1 okay see this n factor of this is equals to 1 so you can easily prove that the milliequivalents of NaOH is equals to millimoles of NaOH so you will get the same result by this equivalent method now you have to decide which method you like most so basically a very simple problem so say stay tuned for discussion, detailed discussions of all the problems of J Advanced 2020 Chemistry. Thank you for watching.